Half terms here, meaning another trip is going to be coming. Another midnight trip, meaning I'm all dressed up, and it is one o'clock right now of Tuesday, May 31st, one o'clock. And so that means there is going to be another midnight trip, and that also means my mum has already booked another holiday ticket. And so, wonder where we're going? I'll see you guys there. Goodbye. You can barely see my face because it is still dark outside. It is around four o'clock right now. We have just went inside our parking. There was a whole huge story. It was hilarious. But we have parked our car in the short stay blue zone. And now we are just heading to the airport. From that blue zone it is around just seven to 10 minute walk. And so we are just arriving inside the airport and gonna see you guys later. out of security and it is 4.41 right now and we are going to duty free and then going to check where our gate is. Thank God we came really early because there was a huge queue as you guys just saw. At every airport we are going through the duty free. It feels like to get everything because everything looks so nice. However, this is a budget trip as we only have our backpacks meaning not need to get anything from G3 and just gonna see you around because we are quite early. We have got breakfast from Leon and we have got a avocado and halloumi muffin right here. Forgot I was about to say burger and muffin and this is going to be our breakfast and also my mum's already started eating. How fun! 99p for four pieces of hash brown and this is really good and so here is the avocado and halloumi burger and let me just open it here and also not just that not just breakfast and coffee you can also get a little dessert right here which looks amazing too and so wait I am really hungry guys <laughs> we have eight we are just waiting 20 more minutes because it is six o'clock right now waiting until 6 20 until our gate shows up and also because we don't know where our gate is we might have to either walk or go on a shuttle bus so we're just going to probably sit there and to wait. go to luxembourg is gate number 52 and so now we are walking towards it because we were just sitting down as you guys saw because it just said to relax and we were just waiting and waiting and waiting but now we are going and we still have an hour left but we're probably just going to be sitting down there so that we do not miss this fight. So I have the whole flight right there and I am going to be going on right now for I do not know how long but now I'm going to be going and boarding the flight so we are going through the front door and I cannot wait. to get out of the airport and also another surprise which I might be doing in another video or you guys might be lucky to see in this video so stay tuned for a day. So we have just passed through the immigration and they have stamped our passports and here there's the baggage claim however because we are backpack traveling and also on a budget so we do not need to collect any baggage at all and so this airport is really easy to go through it kind of reminds me of the Milan 
bergamot apple because it is really quick to go through really small and just easy to go through and the exit is literally right there i can see quite a lot of people just going through it so all you have to do when you come is you pass through immigration and then you just exit and that's it so it's a really nice airport and it seems really nice and sunny outside so i cannot wait to get outside upstairs from the arrivals which were downstairs now that i've come upstairs here is the departures gate and i'm guessing because there was we've had a whole situation on because there's a strike going on in brussels so that's why we have come upstairs now and i think there are a lot of flights which have just come here and so there are a lot of people right behind me just coming upside upstairs because you have to come upstairs to exit and it looks like beautiful weather here it looks really sunny and i cannot wait to explore it so now i'm going to be going outside and now let's see what we have to do now here upstairs in the departures gate it looks really nice honestly i mean there's this whole really nice bakery which i just went to see inside and it looked amazing and so it seems a bit bigger than east midlands but still looks amazing but also it is small like east midlands and quick to go through and handle and yes yeah, so now that i've reached luxembourg you guys will see a lot of luxembourg videos here and so stay tuned for that and i'll see you guys in my next video bye